So today we're going to talk about rasterization as a form of interpolation. So if we have a line right here that starts at x0 and y0 and goes to x1 and y1, and we know the value of y, then what is the value of x right here for a point on the line? In terms of rasterization, this is the same as saying that the edge of the triangle goes from this point to this point, and we know that we're on this scan line y, and we want to figure out the value of x along the edge of the triangle. So here's a line, again, that goes from x0, y0 to x1, y1. So x0, y0 to x1, y1. So we know the value of y, and we want to figure out the value of x. So the value of x is just the value of x at the beginning, plus the amount of distance we've gone in y, which is this right here, which is just y minus y0, times the amount of change in x over the entire span of the line, which is x1 minus x0, divided by the amount of change in y as we go through the entire span of the line. If you think of this in terms of units, then what you have is the new value of x is the initial value of x plus the amount of change in x. And the amount of change in x is um, these units cancel out, and so we end up with the initial value of x times the amount of change in x. So if we think of this as an interpolation problem, then we've started here at the bottom point of a triangle, gone up here to the top point of a triangle, and to figure out where we are on the edge, we simply um, plug values into this formula. So this is a 3, that's a 3, this is about 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and this is about 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we have x0 is equal to 3, y0 is equal to 3 as well, x1 is equal to 10, y1 is equal to 12, and so if we take the O, and the value of y right here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, the value of y is equal to 8, and we want to know the value of x. So we just plug the numbers into the formula and we get x is equal to 3 plus 8 minus 3 times x1 minus x0 is 10 minus 3 divided by y1 minus y0, which is 12 minus 3. And that gives us 3 plus 5 times 7 over 9, which is 3 plus 35 over 9, which is about 3 plus 4, no, 3 plus, whew, 3 plus 3 and 8 ninths, which gives us 6 and 8 ninths. So the value of x right here is 6, 6, and 8 ninths. And that's how we can think of rasterization as interpolation. Now I've done this using x as the value that's being interpolated. If I wanted to interpolate colors across the triangle, and the colors were specified at the vertices, then I could just think of this x value as the value of red down at the bottom vertex, and this x value as the value of red up at the top of the vertex, and this x value as the value of red on this edge of the triangle. So instead of this axis being x, this axis would be red, and I just run the same interpolation game to figure out the values of red along the edge of the triangle. 